Today I'm going to show you how to create the Black Panther movie title text effect in Pixel Lab. This effect is 100% editable and can be saved as a preset for future projects. You can go ahead and watch my other text effect video where I explain how to save text effect as preset so you can reuse it in any project without creating it over again from scratch. Without wasting more time, let's open Pixel Lab and get started. First, we're going to create the texture we'll be using for the effect. Open a blank project with no layers, go to the background color and select gradient fill. For the top color I'm going to be using a light blue with the RGB value of 26, 132, and 212. And for the bottom color, I'm going to be using a black blue with RGB value of 5, 2 and 17. And click OK. Then I'm going to create a color position at the middle and draw it close to the light blue. Then I'm going to drag this one down a little bit like this, and click OK. Now go to Effects and select the Noise option. Reduce the Alpha down to 30 and leave Enhancement at 7. Now go ahead and save the background texture as an image and create a new project for the text effect. Here as you can see I've already typed my text and I'm going to be using this font called Wolfbane. It's a free font at dafont.com. You can go ahead and download it. I'll drop the link in the description. Create a copy of the text and hide the layer temporarily, we're going to need it later. With the text selected, go to texture and select the image we initially created and enable maintain ratio. Open the layers panel and unhide the second text. Bring it below the first text and place it at the middle. With the second text selected, Go to Color and select Gradient Fill. We're going to be using two main colors but we're going to duplicate them multiple times. For the top one, I'm going to be using this yellow with the RGB value of 253, 242 and 0. Copy the hex code, we're going to need it. For the bottom one, I'll be using this orange with the RGB value of 232, 147 and 12. Also copy the color hex code. Now create a new color position and paste the orange hex code. Then move it close to the yellow like this. Create a new one. This time paste the yellow hex code. And move it somewhere here. Repeat this process and follow my steps. Once you're through with that, go to the stroke option and enable it. Set its color to the same gradient we used for the fill and reduce the stroke width to 2. Then go to 3D text and enable it. Reduce the depth to 10, and darken to 20%. Make sure extrude stroke is enabled, and disable the lighting stimulation. Open the layers panel and select the first text. Tap on the stroke option and enable it. Set its color to the orange we used for the gradient, but this time increase the brightness to maximum, and reduce the stroke width to 2. Scroll down to inner shadow and enable it, then reduce the blur radius to 2. Select the second text and enable the shadow option also. Reduce the blur radius to 5, and move the Y axis down to somewhere around 10. And there you have it. The Black Panther title text effect. You can go ahead and make it more unique by adding flares or filters in Photoshop Express or any photo editing app. Remember to leave a like and check out my other video on how to save the effect as a preset. Don't forget to subscribe for similar tutorials like this. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.